y'all give it up for Mr. Lavario. Hey, what's going on? It's your boy, Mr. Locario, the bad boy of the dating game. What's poppin'? So, yo, I got an email from one of my subscribers, and he was basically asking, he was like, you know, how do you um, approach women or talk to women, date women or whatever, without seeming desperate or giving off that desperate, needy energy? You feel what I'm saying? So, you know, he was basically asking me, like, you know, are there any, like, you know, tricks to, you know, not appear desperate or not appear needy and i was basically telling him that the problem is is that you're trying to appear this way instead of just not being desperate and needy so it's a difference between trying to appear a certain way and actually being this way you understand so the thing is is that when you step up your game and when you actually have game you will not appear needy because you won't be needy you won't be desperate you won't put that out there so the thing is is that you know i'll give you an example if you have a dude who doesn't really have that much game, he doesn't understand, you know, what it is he needs to do. And again, game is basically skill or strategy to get what you're trying to get. So this guy doesn't have any really any skill or strategy to get these chicks. So what happens is, is that let's say, you know, by circumstance, he runs into some girl that maybe his friends know that hooked them up. And now this is the only girl he's dating. And he hasn't dated a girl in a long time. He hasn't had sex in a while. So now he's, you know, he, he's trying to make sure it works out with this girl because he's like, oh, man, I, I really want her. I really need her. And I haven't been with a, out in, with a girl in a long time. And I really like this girl. So what happens is, is that he starts to become needy. He starts to give off that desperate type of energy. And he keeps sweating her. He keeps calling her. He keeps doing all this other stuff. And then he ends up driving her away because he was basically just dealing with that one girl. Right. So you have another guy who has game, who has a better skill and strategy than this guy. What he does is he says, OK, I'm going to learn how to approach girls, talk to girls so that when I go out there and talk to them, I have a better chance of getting more women to talk to and to have numbers and go on dates and stuff. So once he does that, he doesn't actually have this desperate, needy energy because he has more women to deal with. He can call this girl up, call that girl up because he's put himself in a position to have that work for him. So the thing is, is that, you know, the reason why you're feeling needy or, or you're, you, you think that you're appearing to be needy or desperate or whatever is because your gate in your game, you feel like there's this lack of, of, you know, abundance of women. And that is making you want to like kind of latch on and grab on to whatever woman that you're dealing with or you're coming into contact with. So the thing is, is that, if you step up your game and you have a little bit more, you know, basically a better strategy of how you're doing things, you will have a better chance of getting women and attracting women. And therefore, you won't be desperate and you won't be needy. You understand? So you won't have to pretend because what a lot of guys do is, you know, uh, guys used to do this shit where they would, uh, you know, you get a girl's number and you're like, OK, well. I'm going to wait three days to call her so I don't appear desperate or needy and all this other shit. And the thing is, is that, you know, if you're dealing with other women, if you have other things going on in your life, if you're making other things happen and you're not making women this big thing, you won't be needy. You won't be desperate because you actually have other shit popping off. You understand? The guys that are usually desperate and needy or, you know, appear desperate and needy is because they don't have anything else going on but that one girl they're dealing with. You feel what I'm saying? So the thing you have to understand is, is that it's not about trying to appear a certain way. It's about you actually being this way. And it's about you actually, you know, being a guy who's not desperate, being a guy who's not needy, instead of trying to appear like you're not needy or desperate. You feel what I'm saying? And that comes along with you having skill, you having strategy, you having your game up to par. You feel what I'm saying? So that is it, guys. Listen. What you need to do now is click the link below and get my free ebook, The Magnificent 10 Crucial Dating Tips for Men. Also, click the link under that so you can join my membership program where you get 45 to 90 minute audios every month. It is fire, okay? So, that is it. If you have any questions, hit me up at askmrlopario at gmail.com. All right, I'm out of here. Remember, the truth is inside you. Peace.